full speed in the lane, still getting it. <laughs>Dude, I thought you could get down this way. Oh yeah, you can. Alright, where was that baseball bat? Oh, it's a splitting axe. Fuck yes. Let's go see if we can whoop this guy's ass. I just, I wish it would become daytime. Did I get him? He's like floating up the stairs. Is he dead? I must have killed him. Wait! Oh, fucking, you, you've got to be kidding me. Wait, why am I hurt? Oh, he must have hit me. 
Shit, I don't have a bandage either. Holy fuck, I lost a lot of blood just off that little bit. I can't see shit now. I feel warm blood on my clothes. Yep, well, we're gonna die. We are gonna die. But at least I got a kill. That guy should have picked up the axe, man. I don't know what he hit me with, though. I don't know what he had on him. There's no way, though, with bleeding like this, I'm gonna survive. It's getting darker. I need a bandage. And then a blood pack. Help! Yeah, we're definitely gonna die. Wow, this looks really bad when you're losing blood. Oh, we might as well run for over here, check these houses again. Hey, get out of the bag. Be a good boy. Dude, I wonder how long I'm gonna bleed for. Every time I start recording, the dog feels the need to come in the bedroom and start fucking with everything. No, you're not. Oh my god. Seriously? Come on, dude. Go. Oh my god, I almost just want to die. Let's find a zombie and let him eat me. Is that a zombie? It's gotta be. Kill me, zombie, kill me. Holy shit, dude. I cannot accept defeat. So guys, survival episode one is going to turn into me surviving for like ten minutes and then dying. They definitely need more bandages around here. What's up, bro? Holy shit, like, trying, trying to pick up loot is a problem also, guys. It's like, you gotta be, like, exactly at, like, just the perfect, even opening doors and shit. Oh, okay, it was already open. And I cannot see shit. Holy fuck, how long am I gonna bleed for? Alright, maybe I should have just let that zombie kill me. I need my flashlight in my hand.
Yeah, it's I can't see shit, dude. Come zombies, kill me. I hear you. Is that a zombie down there? I believe it is, and I'm gonna let him kill me this time. Is it a zombie or is that a goddamn tree? It's a goddamn tree. Damn it. There's a zombie. Yeah, come at me, bro. Kill me, please. Thank God. Ah, uh, we're in Kamenka. See, there is a lot more enterable buildings, guys. That I will say. Which is nice. It's... I don't know. It adds, like, a whole new aspect of being able to enter just just about every building you come across. Don't know if you can go inside that one or not. Jesus Christ, come on, man. All right, I got a baseball cap. See, it's so fucking dark, like, it, it's... It's really taking out the enjoyment of the game when, like, you can't see a fucking thing. Like, you, you don't really get the feel of what this game looks like because every single server that you go in is dark, and when it's dark, it just kind of, like, changes the whole fucking... Canned sardines. Ah, uh, you really gotta be, like... God damn it. No, I did not want to do that. Nothing really here. I need to get somewhere good, like the fucking airfield or something. What is this? Ooh, some shoes. Which I'm apparently not going to be able to pick up. So it's not giving me the option to. Basically the same shoes I have though. And I 
Doesn't look like you can put them there. Might as well replace them though, because those are brand new, it looks like. Alright. What the fuck is that? Is that a motorcycle helmet? Hell yes! You know, I wonder... It's not like allowing me to pick shit up because I have. Holy shit, trying to pick up loot is absolutely impossible. Oh, yeah. So I guess that's how we're going to have to do it from now on. And I heard a zombie around here somewhere. Nothing in here, I don't think. Nope. Wonder if we can get in this one. Yes, we can. I usually never find much of anything in these buildings for some reason. Maybe a piece of clothing will be behind the counter here. Yep. <laughs> I hear... Y'all friendly. Same. Oh, there's something on there. Can I get back there? Alright, thanks. Did he have any trouble finding loot? Are you having trouble finding loot? I'm having trouble finding guns. Yeah, same. I can't find, like, any bandages, any guns, any ammo. Oh, well, here's some bandages if you need them. Oh, okay, you got some? Wonder, how do you split? I'm gonna warn you, be careful when using them, because there's a chance that they'll give you infections. Oh, okay. Thanks. Damn, a bandage will give you an infection? That kinda sucks. I guess it's realistic, though. I already check in here.
don't believe I did. Oh, I should have asked that kid if he played in fucking any server other than a nighttime server yet. Fuck you, zombie. I gotta get to like below the airfield or something like that. What is this? Green jeans. All right. That's what I'm talking about. Now we can match. Everything's green. Oh, the helmet's a little damaged. Oh well. Wonder, wonder how close I can sneak by a zombie. Nope, not that close. Oh, no fair. He can just run right through the fence. That's bullshit. Unfair advantage. Probably shouldn't trap myself in here like this, but whatever. I'm gonna eventually die anyway, so... So I don't know what that kid's talking about. I'm having trouble finding, like, any kind of loot. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. No, you're not allowed to come inside. Nope. Fuck you, zombie. Alright, let's head down this way. See if we can lose this zombie. I guess I'm just gonna keep the coast to my left and see how... See how far I can get. What do you do? Put the flashlight away or something? Because if we can get to Beloda, then uh, that would be nice. All right, somebody was apparently just through here. <clears throat> Dude, what happened, bro? Oh, no, that's a white t-shirt. Yeah, so he's that. Oh, wait, my battery, or my flashlight ran out of batteries. That's what it was. So now I got another flashlight with some, with a fresh battery, so.
Yeah, now we're right back at this place, which was my first spawn point. So. But we gotta get down there somehow, so. Let's check this out real quick. <clears throat> well, at least I got my first kill. Beat that motherfucker with a baseball bat. That's what's up. I just, I want to find a gun. I want to find a gun and I want it to turn daylight, damn it. I want to see what this game looks like in the daylight, but it's been kind of impossible to do that so far. Maybe we'll actually find something good in here this time. Is this a backpack? Yes, a violet. God, violet. Oh, don't I just look fucking beautiful. I look glamorous, don't I? Got my green motorcycle helmet, green raincoat, green pants, blue shoes, and bright fucking purple Barney backpack. But it's better than no backpack at all. And I guess during the night you can't really stand out, so... Ooh, is that food? Root beer! Alright. Now yeah, that's all full. Wait, there should be another can. Don't know what kind that is, but it's something. So now at least I got a couple drinks. Ooh, a head torch. Oh, cool. Oh, it's badly damaged, though. That's bad. That's pretty damaged, though, too, so. I wonder if we have to put batteries in this bitch. Yep. How does it turn on now? Oh, there we go. Nice! Now I can actually see what's in front of me instead of the flashlight that's like all off to the fucking left and shit. We gotta go on and, like, turn it off like this every time, though. That kinda sucks. Alright, you wanna drink something? Let's crack it open, bro. You have drunk a Zluta Cola Loca Soda. Gotcha. That's awesome. Let's turn this shit on a little bit and see if we can find something else in here. Is this a canteen? No, a stone. The fuck do I need a stone for? That might, I don't know, maybe for Tate or making a fire or something. Looks like that's about it. For the grocery store. Yep. Shut it off. Alright guys, well I am going to go ahead and end, end this episode here. If you are enjoying this series and would like to see me do more of it, let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to leave a like, and we will see you guys next time.